Hello friends, and welcome back. In this video, we delve into the latest developments surrounding the Tori Dam, currently under construction in Zabul province of southern Afghanistan. We'll explore the invaluable contributions and advantages this dam brings to the local populace, as well as the challenges it addresses and its current progress status. Commencing nearly a year ago, construction efforts have advanced significantly, nearing completion. Initially staffed by 65 workers, the workforce has now reduced to approximately 30 individuals due to diminished workload demands. Workers hailing from various Afghan provinces contribute to this ambitious undertaking. Situated just four kilometers from Khalid City, the capital of Zabul province, Tori Dam stands as a testament to Afghan engineering prowess. With a budget of 97 million Afghanis, the dam aims to mitigate monsoon floods, irrigate agricultural lands, and fortify subterranean water reservoirs. Standing at 25 meters tall, the dam boasts a storage capacity of 2.9 million cubic meters of water and a 100 kilowatts electricity generation capacity. The width of the dam is said to be around 70 meters and its length 25 meters. After completion, it will irrigate 600 acres of agricultural land. It will also be able to produce 100 kilowatts of electricity. Work on the project was originally prepared in May of 2021. Upon completion, the dam is poised to irrigate 600 hectares of agricultural land, benefiting thousands of families. Prior to its construction, these lands lay barren and arid, devoid of agricultural activity. The initiative, entirely engineered and designed by Afghans, has garnered widespread approval from Zabul residents who advocate for the construction of additional dams to alleviate water scarcity concerns among farmers. The Tori Dam epitomizes development in Zabul province. Beyond flood control, its primary objectives encompass agricultural enhancement and groundwater reinforcement. Zabul, with its diverse climatic conditions, grapples with monsoon floods and seasonal river inundation. The dam's formidable stature and vast storage capacity offer respite by mitigating floods and minimizing associated damages, thereby bolstering environmental and economic security. Effective irrigation is pivotal for agricultural prosperity. Tory Dam's substantial water reservoirs promise ample opportunities for land cultivation and increased crop yields, thus fostering economic growth and job creation. In a nation plagued by water scarcity issues, the dam represents a beacon of hope, ensuring sustainable water resource management and ecological equilibrium preservation. Moreover, the dam emerges as an energy hub capable of generating 100 kilowatts of electricity. This indigenous energy production alleviates regional dependence on external sources, bolstering self-sufficiency and fostering economic autonomy. Infrastructure projects like Tory Dam stimulate local employment, imparting valuable skills and expertise to the community. Tory Dam's multifaceted impact transcends mere infrastructure development. It serves as a catalyst for social and economic progress, elevating living standards, augmenting incomes, and nurturing developmental opportunities. As a symbol of regional advancement, the project instills hope and motivation within the local populace, fostering a sense of collective prosperity and well-being. Furthermore, the project underscores the importance of local capacity building and skill enhancement. By empowering communities with engineering proficiency and project management acumen, the dam engenders sustainable job opportunities and attracts domestic and foreign investments, thereby fostering long-term socio-economic growth. The Tory Dam project embodies a holistic approach to sustainable development. By addressing water scarcity, enhancing agricultural productivity, and mitigating environmental hazards, it aligns with both local and global sustainable development objectives. 
through meticulous supervision and adherence to quality standards, the project ensures the realization of its intended goals while fostering social cohesion and environmental stewardship. Overall, Afghanistan has the rights to take advantage of its water resources for its development in line with the UN International Water Courses Convention without harming the environment and rights of riparian countries. The development of water infrastructure and dams can produce several positive results for Afghanistan, such as reducing dependency on imported hydropower and improving the availability of water for irrigation and livestock. Yet this must be complemented with effective diplomacy to engage in water negotiations and provide platform for dialogues and signing formal agreements with its neighboring countries. For a successful water diplomacy, Afghanistan should have strong institutional and technical capacities which will strengthen Afghanistan's position in bilateral and multilateral dialogues with its neighbors. To further improve its capacities, Afghanistan should take advantage of the knowledge and skills of its diaspora across the world, while its public institutions should conduct more research on water science and hydro-meteorological management systems. This will help to ensure that when Afghanistan does find peace, it will be sustainable.